We will reach the planet in 10 minutes, 45 seconds. Okay, keep me informed. Boost up those engines, boys. Yes, sir. We will reach the planet in 2 minutes, 52 seconds. Thank you. Prepare the ship for landing. Right away, Captain. Lost an engine back and I have already one chain which is working on it right now. Okay, stop the engines and switch to secondary power system. Just a second, Captain. Here we go. So someone must switch it manually, right? Yes, Captain. Then you go and switch the power. Right away, sir. I hope Jane can fix the engines. If she doesn't, we won't be able to get the stone. And we won't be able to get home either. Is the land crew still sleeping? Hope so. But their sleeping draught is controlled by the spaceship main computer. So, with the powers down, they might wake up in a few seconds. I wake up and everything is dark. Strange. What's up with the lighting? And why aren't the engines rumbling? I start thinking that we might have been attacked. I don't know what happened, but I'm going to find out. Somebody is moving in the darkness. He's too calm. Maybe he's one of the attackers. This face is familiar. I think he was the co-pilot or something. Maybe they are controlling the other crew members. I can't trust anybody. I think I could navigate the ship back to Earth, but I have to get to the command bridge first. What's taking so long? It's nothing more than pushing a goddamn button. I'll go and check on him. Someone's coming. Oxygen level is getting lower. Open the case for the emergency oxygen supplies. This was the pilot of the ship. The attackers killed him. But why didn't they take control of him? <laughs> 